Round two. Are, are we starting now? Round two. Welcome back to old sassy grandpa. Welcome back to WWE. G F O S G D G. Yeah, uh, I literally forgot what I was doing. We were just discussing the other day, or today, that if I had a child, I would name him Grandpa. Middle name, wait for it. Middle name, wait for it. I saw How I Met Your Mother, by the way. What? Like, in general? Yeah, the, the show that yeah. everyone's been bugging you to watch. For like with, the last with, 20, 100 years. With Neil Patrick Harris. All in PH, man. And uh, that was that was one of his jokes. Was it? Middle yeah. name, wait for it? Yeah. He's gotcha. like, you got the best middle name ever. Wait for it. I'm waiting. No, wait for it. Yeah. I'm still waiting. Wait for it. You are absolutely right. You got a who's on first type situation? Yeah. Wait, have you ever heard that? The full, like, who's, who's on first type thing? Yeah. Yeah, it's, uh, silly. Freaking, uh... Uh, God. My old math teacher. Mr. Uh, biker buff guy who used got to... Got it, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, old man. Old man. You knew him, right? No. Ah, oh, dude. Uh... He was older than Brad here. <laughs> um, but, yeah, he used to do the whole who's on first thing with the entire class. Come on, come on, I can do this. I can do this. Go, Brad. Go, Brad. It Go is Brad. my birthday. Go, Brad. He just karate chopped you. He did. I need more jerky. Why do I suck all of a sudden? I was really good at this game the other day. Yeah, probably because you... Cool. God, you're so that stupid. That should be it. God, take it. Checks his hair. Alright, maybe he just, like, didn't check his hair as much last time. Maybe buster punches are, like, one of the weakest moves. No, it's, like, the only move I can use. Oh, is it really? Yeah. Can God. you just escape? Damn it, no. Or it would, it would defeat... It would, I'm trying to get past him, so it's not gonna help. Why don't you... I'm also, all, I'm also on fire. Why don't you use a bottle? Because I got this. Uh, uh, Why is guarding even an option? Because you can guard. Alright. Die, you... Yes! Thank you. Damn it! All Hopefully right. she's already dead so I can see her in hell. Jesus Christ, guy. Yeah, they're, they're, they're spiteful. I'm going to name my child Grandpa. That is my goal. That is my one Jump wish. off that cliff. I can't. Okay. Uh, okay. Just going to hop on. Oh, wait, how do I do that? How do I get over there? Oh, cool. Yay! Whee! Domestic jerky. Wow. That's the good shit. All right, go over here. Who's that guy? Pop, pop, I don't know. We're going to say hi to him, though. Are you sure he wants to say hi? Uh, no. Holla, holla, if you hear me. Really need to get that off my chest. What? Oh, okay. <laughs> He's dead. <laughs> Alrighty. Well, it was nice knowing you, guy. They're dead. All right. Still dead. dead. Uh, this guy dead? Yeah, he's dead. Okay, he's dead. What about this car? Dead. Got it. What about that crow? Oh, oh. Alive. Oh. Alright. He's dead. He seems dead. I'm not sure, though. Oh, oh his... I got a worn helmet. Yeah. Can I put it on? No. Why not? I just, I, I just can't. That's stupid. They're dead. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> you suffered serious damage. Time is a great teacher. Sadly, it kills all its pupils. Oh, damn. That was... Oh, shit. You got a badass scar. Yeah, permanent. Down, Why is this guy riding a deer? Down, down. This guy's seriously riding a deer? Howdy, motherfucker. Our past has crossed yet again. Do you remember our time spent as we lads? I do. Finally. My heart just tumbles with joy thinking about it. Like your head in a dry. 
Normally you'd be dead and stripped of your wares by now, but I like you, Brad. Let's have some fun. I shall give you a choice. Your yellow-shirted friend's life or all of your belongings. Choose wisely. What will you give us? Uh, Terry seems useless. Yeah, but like I don't have that much shit. You have bottles and jerky? Yeah, I can get more, though. What should I do? Oh, God. Is Terry even worth anything? I mean, literally, no. He's not worth anything. Is this a game that's based on decisions? I don't know. I don't know well enough. Oh, God. All your belongings. Yeah, I was gonna say, I like Terry. Hm. How boring. Uh, Alright, boys. Strip him quickly. I hear tell that a female is on the loose. My loins ache for some excitement. Off we go. Terry? You better... Oh, my God. Just... Oh. Ter Terry's dead. <laughs> go to... He's dead. Son of a bitch. Still there. Yeah, permanent scar. That's badass. Isn't it? Hello? They're dead. Still, Still dead. dead. Alright, let's go this way. Terry? I swear to God. Ugh. My head? Whoa. You look like him. Are you okay, dude? What happened? Uh, we got hit by a truck. It was some old friends. Everything's okay now. Damn. First my hamstring, now this. You're a bad omen. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> yeah, I guess so. Well, it's all good, man. I don't mind. <laughs> How I came out with you. Mm, you get Terry Hints joined you again. Alright, back to work. Doing whatever the fuck it is that I am doing. I'm a man on a mission. I'm gonna roam the desert looking for women. This is a fun one. This man is hanging. He's got some nipples. He, uh, I can he see does. them. So, I know what happens here. Check He's this out. got a red Walk scarf. Walk up. That hurts you, like, tremendously. His ass just blew out. It's more of his stomach, but whatever. That was gross. It was gross. I'm a and man And I got hit by it, and it's attracted a lot of damage. Going through the desert, looking for some women. Man on oh, a mission. No items, no weapons, no armor. No, okay, yeah, I actually did get everything. I lost everything because I saved some guy's life. <laughs> I don't even like this guy. I saved his life. I'm an idiot and jump off cliffs. Yeah, I, I could I could agree with that. Boom, boom. Let's but sometimes I get it right. This guy. This guy's cool. Seems like a storm's brewing around here. You look tired, are you hungry? If you had an empty bottle, you could have some of my soup. Also, you could rest in my tent. Too bad I sold all my bottles and didn't really sell them. I gave them away. Was that an earthquake? Holy heck. Alright, so... The world can be saved. Find her. Status effects. Oh, so all these are status effects. Cool. Regenerates my HP. Cool pick, huh? Asterstick. Depression makes life suck. Withdrawal hurts Ar you all over. Arteristic. It's like Terry. Arteristic. Arteristic. Joy makes it all better. Cry obscures your vision. Yeah, see, uh, see withdrawal at the bottom? Yeah, I already yeah. read all that. Hangover reduces everything. Drunk. <laughs> it reduces everything. Strong. But slow and dumb. Yeah, so these are like all the uh, the status effects, and they're really weird. I like, I, I think I like all of these. Yeah. I like cool. Looks like Saitama with sunglasses. It does. Alright, anyway. So, see this guy here? The one who looks like he's jerking off? Uh, I guess so, yeah. Why were you backwards? I don't know. This guy is waiting to Oh, got it. Look at the crow. Not of it. No? Weird. Is way what? This guy's waiting to ambush me. So what I can do is... Alright, so the question... <laughs> <laughs> that was fantastic. Worth it. 
Congratulations. I think I've broken my neck. And to think, I was supposed to ambush you. How the tables have turned. <laughs> I got him. By jumping off some cliffs. Now, I'm actually gonna... Oops, I didn't mean to actually quit. Hold on. I need the HP from that guy, or the experience from that guy. But I really wanted to, uh... To show that little, little bit. That was nice. Wasn't it? This game's pretty awesome. I like it a lot. Alright, so so this is also great. Aw, oh, damn it! God, no! I like how he ran. No, hold on. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta do the thing. Because there's like three ways of confronting him, apparently. Alright. So if I go over here, right, I can just walk up to him. Walk two steps to the left, please. Uh. <laughs> what the fuck? <clears throat> that, I like that one. Oh, shit, I am not equipped for this. Uh. An unexpected quick to the girl. <laughs> Fantastic. Yeah, I'm gonna lose this one. Yep, absolutely gonna lose this one. Can I flee? I cannot escape. I died. This is horrible. You did it. You did it. Uh, you did it. Okay. Yeah. God, you suck. You did uh, it. Okay. Let's go. Let's go do a little, little, little foraging real quick. He's full of holes. So uh, before we go back to that guy. Look. Some Sully's, chickens. Some chickens. Uh, He's the chicken man. Leave. And cock a doodle doo. Take your pervert war elsewhere. I want no part of this. What if you approach him from behind? I. You, nothing. Oh, really? Yeah. There we go. Bottle. Go through the hole. So. Fun little weird fact about this game. There are apparently no random encounters, except for, like, one place. Really? So everything else is, like, a, a thing. Uh, this is probably one of my favorite parts of the game. That you've seen so far. It's a bucket. That was a nice bucket. Tommy, don't play with the matches. How'd you even get those, sport? Give them to... Oh, shit. What do you want? I'm looking for a child. This is my orphanage. All these kids have been abandoned. I'm taking care of them because no one else will. Wait, wait, hold on. <clears throat> Why? What? Uh. When were the women uh wiped out? Not that long ago. I hope so. Why are you? Uh oh, Tommy! <laughs> now look what you did. It's okay, sport. We'll get that put out. Hey, could you uh, hand me that bucket of water? All right. You fool! Not that bucket! That was my gasoline bucket! That bucket! Oh, shit! Uh, uh, get, okay, okay. Uh, Alright. Uh, okay. Uh, uh, okay. You uh, presumptuous uh, bitch! Uh, Alright, I got the bucket. Uh, 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 Alright. Uh, oh. Tommy, I'm so sorry. Uh, 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 oh god, I'm, uh, I'm so sorry about what happened here too late this is the second most tragic thing to happen in my life uh uh i'm sorry yeah i'll see you later can you actually go and get the actual bucket no. really yeah like it's not actually there no it's not, you, you can't go past the kids i don't think until he triggers that you let those kids on fire yeah see the red skulls it means Randall's army's taking over which sucks because they only gas even the mouses in there i don't think i'm gonna make fire bombs all right, so uh, just gonna explore for a while. And remember how to remember how to do things. What the fuck? You got this one. Hey pal, you okay? What's wrong? Getting sentimental, brother? Oh uh, no, just asking. Oh, here it comes. I'm closing my eyes. Good night, Olatha. Oh, fuck. <coughs> Dude, calm down. 
I'm dying. Stop it. <coughs> He's left. Oh, shit. God, why? Oh, fuck. All right, hold on. Well, God. Mm. All right, everybody, welcome back. Uh, off screen, I walked around for a while and kind of got an idea of where to go. Uh, I killed the guy who was ambushing us because I thought I was just going to die anyway. But it turns out, uh, like, three turns, I, I beat him. But I'm going to go rest in this tent, and we're going to see what happens. Because this guy's cool. Uh, actually, like, I took some soup. And I'm going to go rest here and see what happens. Uh, yeah, rest here because I need some health. A little ceremonial uh, wedding day bells. All right. So, we'll see what happens here. Okay, all good. Nothing happened. Nathan's uh, drinking bubble tea. Or rather, eating parts of the bubble tea. I live an exquisite lifestyle. He does. I enjoy sushi and long walks using Lamborghinis. <laughs> I like that. Long walks using... That's great. Nathan, uh, I'm looking for a character. I'd like you to voice him, okay? Uh, um, <clears throat> but he's like, a, he's like a mysterious type character, so can you get like a, like a powerful, mysterious voice ready for me? Uh... Sure. All right, like a like a deep, like mysterious kind of person. Like, his voice is deep, or he is a deep person. Like he's a deep, mysterious person. This guy. This is him. Oh 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 shit! This looks this looks tough. Do you got a voice ready? All right, hold on. Oh, hello there. My name is Nern. I'm considered the greatest historian of our time. You might speak up a bit. I'm not sure the, the thing is capturing you. I'm considered the greatest historian <laughs> of our time. I've gathered a wealth of knowledge about Olathe and what happened. Many tales. Would you like to hear? Yeah, I, I totally care. Hmm. I wish you were more enthusiastic. Oh well, I'll tell you anyway. Let's see. Oh right, it all started with that, uh, with what I like to call The Flash. The superhero from DC Marvel Comics. Oh, or DC Comics. Uh, I like him. I was sitting with my wife, God rest her soul, sipping on sweet lemon bubble tea. I believe it was homemade by my sweet lemon bubble tea wife, God rest her soul. Or wait, maybe she bought it from the store in a bottle. Y you know, like a plastic bottle. Well, well, hold on now. That would be ridiculous to buy a bottle of sweet lemon tea, then transfer the contents into a glass. Why not just drink it from the bottle? I, I guess maybe so she could put ice in the glass? But then again, making tea homemade would be just as time consuming, if not more. That sneaky bitch. Anyway, I'll save that story for later. So I'm sitting on my porch drinking sweet lemon bubble tea. From a glass, of course. <laughs> Glasses. When suddenly, a great strangeness fills my body. Something wrong. I've lived many years and I've never felt something like this before. Do you know what it was? Yep. It was my rocking chair. That wooden son of a gun stopped rocking. So I looked down and realized a little rock had gotten caught beneath my chair. A rock under my rocking chair. Oh, wow, that's, uh... It's deep. It's fascinating. Uh, it's deep, It's huh? great, yeah. Uh, I decided that's it was a, time oh, for God. bed. You, you listen to this! I decided it was time for bed. I had a little bit too much excitement. Are you listening? Yeah. I had a little bit too much excitement Jesus. for one day. Ho, ho, ho. You shut up. I slid into my jammies, brushed my teeth. I swear to God, boy, you listening. Sl uh. I slid into my jammies, brushed my teeth, and said my prayers. As I was climbing into my bed, I noticed my wife. Don't you be thinking no dirty thoughts. God rest her soul. Brushing her hair in the bathroom. As I peered across the hall, my body swelled up with emotion. 
Why can't I be married to an attractive woman? <laughs> Is it me? My bank account? Am I... I'm a tall guy. I work out 40 minutes a week. Is that not enough? Now, my neighbor at the time, Tom Fortnite, was a very short son of a bitch. His wife, Karen Fortnite Platterberger. Yeah, one of those women. Oh, yeah. Well, she was more attractive than my wife. I'd say she was a short, a, a soft six, whereas my wife was a hard four. What's the deal? I thought women liked tall men. Oh, my God. Why was Karen with him? Why, man? Anyway, that's right. That's what I'm thinking. Why? Oh, God. Okay, anyway, my whore, my horse of a wife, God rest her soul, uh, crawls into bed next to me, and I, I, she decided to leave the bedside light on so she could read her goddamn book. It's one of her romance novels again. Give me a fucking break, I said, as if I don't already feel inadequate enough, like my dick is not small. Now, not only do I have to compete with Tom, now you shut up, you bold son of a bitch. Now I have to deal with these fictional hunks. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, uh... Oh, that did say I, I, I. <laughs> At this point, I had already suppressed the urges of intimacy. I rolled over and tried to sleep. Her bedside light was only a minor annoyance. I was able to drift off. Then I woke up to a big flash of light, not just any light. That's about it. Now leave me alone. Jeez, you're kind of smothering me. I'll talk to you later. Ugh. I can tell uh. by the way you're walking away that you don't want to leave. You want to hear another story. If you really want to hear another story, I'll tell you once upon a hot summer night. Sometime in July. Was it July? I, my <laughs> local grocery store sells really good... E eggs. <laughs> in July. <laughs> I thought it said E99s. <laughs> Really good E99s. Oh, God. I don't know why. Do chickens operate better in heat? Uh, fireworks, maybe. I don't know. I, I don't want to get off topic. Oh, but the point is, the eggs that summer were marvelous. Jesus. Anyway, my wife and I, God rest her soul, went to the barbecue that night. I just need to leave, man. It was held at Dale Spooner's house. Oh. But you're really curious, I know. Well, oh. his backyard... Con Connie Spooner doesn't want people in her home. I, I think she's just an uptight bitch. But, you know... Uh, so this barbecue, I see uh, none other than, that's right. Are you curious? I know, I know you can uh, read it, I, uh, but I, I'm I, very curious. Please. Tom fucking Fortnite. Uh, can you fucking believe this shit? Now earlier in the day, my wife, God rest her soul, had made potato salad for the barbecue. Personally, I hate potato salad. I'm a mash. Uh, I'm a mashed kind of fellow. <laughs> Like my wife, ho-ho. Oh. So I sat in the TV room avoiding her till the barbecue. Because, God, I fucking hate my... Uh, Once we were at the party, I made sure to distance myself from my dumb potato bitch wife. God, God rest, rest her soul. I, I just didn't want anything to think I would associate with someone that would, you know, bring a potato salad, not mashed potatoes. I know. You know? Anyway, Tom and yeah. his above-mediocre wife were already there. And I'm telling you, Tom's mediocre... Above-mediocre wife. Oh, God. Oh, don't get me started. Yeah, and get I'm this... Not... They brought a I'm fruit salad me. with whipped cream. God oh, whipped fucking cream. damn it, they showed us. The nerve of those fork knights. Yeah. Needless to say, I gave my wife, God rest her soul, a couple choice words about whipped cream versus potato salad. Son of a bitch. A real tongue lashing. Goodbye forever. Hold on, are you leaving me? We're, we're never I saw earlier in the same file that I was in your party. We're, uh, yeah. I'm never talking to him again. You want to be in my... <laughs> well, hello again. <laughs> Funny seeing you here. Uh, uh, <laughs> you might be asking yourself, how did I get here? Anyway, I often wonder what all I had, what all happened here. What was that big flash? Why are we here? What happened to the barbecue? Even our night and day cycle is odd. Sometimes days last ages and nights come rarely. And those clouds... So strange. What's happened to our Earth? Oh, well, enough of that boring stuff. 
I once had a real kooky day at the doctor's office. <laughs> I was in the waiting room reading a teen magazine. What am I doing reading a teen magazine? You may be asking yourself. I'm looking at above average women. I'll tell you what about. I'll tell you about that later. Normally, I don't indulge in adolescence uh, publications, but I couldn't resist. Uh, I recently heard the new artist on the radio, Ulysses Utensils. Uh, She's some young woman. Maybe a boy. I don't know. You know how these kids are these days. I know! Either way, that clinic can really grasp my attention. Child? A child can really <laughs> grasp my attention. So I'm reading this magazine because I saw Ulysses on the cover. I still wasn't able to identify if it was a man or a woman, but as I'm reading, I notice something on the ceiling. You might be curious as to what that might be oh, on the ceiling. Yeah, just cover the screen so I can't read. I look up to see that there is some water damage. Can you believe that? No. No, oh. I can't believe it. All right. All right. Well, you'd think a doctor would make enough money to maintain his office. I guess he cares about his cool jet skis more than his patient's fucking comfort and his... Assumably, big house and hard-bodied wife. God damn it! I wish my wife was like that. <laughs> big old, big old uh, <laughs> melons that she got from the grocery store, where she had bought the goddamn potato salad. Let me tell you so, about that. <laughs> what <a> bitch! <laughs> Just then, a droplet of water falls from the ceiling. My eyes trail it all the way down to the ground. I stared at the floor for some time, watching the carpet absorb the water. Suddenly, my attention is caught by a small child. The child was glaring directly at me. I saw the devil looking right back at me beneath his eyes. I got nervous and quickly stared directly at my fetus to not aggravate the child. And that's when I noticed something. I was wearing two different kinds of socks. God. Golly, I'm all revved up after these thrilling exchanges. To be fair, you're a bit of a bore. But beggars can't be choosers. I think I'll stick around. I've got many to tell the tale. Naren Guan, join your party. All right. All right, let me tell you a story there, Brad. All right, no, we're done. Later, everybody. Oh, yeah. I got more for you later, no, guys. No, Nern. Boy.